Dude. Thank you guys for coming to see me. How you doing? Dude, I'm doing good. This is a fortress. It's insane. Congratulations. Thank you. I just bought a house already done. I couldn't even imagine how much work this was. It's been three years in the making. And we're finally like, I haven't quite moved in yet. Any day I'm gonna finally get like the sign off. I'm so oh. excited. This is gonna be so crazy. It's wild. This is like the side you live in and then this is yep, all exactly, garage yeah. and then underground as well. Yep, uh -huh. Funny part about it though, I didn't even wanna build the house but the bank wouldn't finance just the garage because like, it doesn't have enough livable square footage. So I had to build this. And there's all these bedrooms that are all empty, so you guys gotta come more often. Oh yeah. Free place to stay, stay for a week, like, well, stay as long as privilege. you want. <laughs> <laughs> Look what's behind you. Yes, yes. Forget this. Look what this, oh man. I'm so happy you just went like full pink and chrome on the Bugatti. I had wanted to do the chrome look for so long. And yeah. just like on a Bugatti, like from factory. Classic. There's so many chrome like special yeah. editions. And with the pink, I think it looks so cool. So sick. And then we've got, of course, a wide body. And this is paint. Factory Lamborghini paint. You say it. You say the word. Rosa Acantis. Okay. Actually, I can pull that off. Rosa Acantis. Yeah, this is really beautiful. Wow, That's look at that. Look at the stitch. How long to do that interior? It didn't take that long. It was like a four week process. Wow, that's pretty fast. I had to ship the car to Florida and back though. So that was kind of unfortunate. To Florida? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. These guys are good though. I mean, it looks amazing. They like custom matched the seat belts to the paint too and the steering wheel and all the carbon fiber. And yeah, I mean, they did a phenomenal job in such a fast period of time. We see cars all the time and you see cars on the internet. And then there's, there's internet cars where it's like, they look good from far, but sometimes they're far from good. Like some of my cars. <laughs> Don't look too close. Is there, we could walk, there's, there's a couple flaws here. It like, looks pretty, uh, like, driving. usually I drive when, it all the time. When you, well, I mean, of course. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Daily you, this. You get it, yeah. Um, this interior, though, like, is really nice. Like, the stitching's all straight. It's they really, like, they did a really amazing it job. It makes me want to do more interiors. Because, like, filming in this with the white interior, it's, like, glowing. Oh, it looks Whoa, so good. It's so cool. House tour? Absolutely. Where do, do where do we start? Back here, front door, knock on your door, door pretend like it's MTV Cribs. The cool thing cribs. about the house, it's actually one big circle. So there's the bridge that goes across to the garage, yeah. but then there's an underground tunnel through the basement. So we can start anywhere and make a full circle. You went El Chapo and got an escape tunnel underground? That's pretty Absolutely. cool. How far out does it go? We can't tell, that's a secret. Can't yeah, 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 come on. Where it ends hey, up don't, like, you know, Don't sell me out like that. that. Bunker and Honestly, I was actually just miles. talking to my contractors about building another tunnel. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, here we yeah, go. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, MTV Cribs style the strad man's home this is gonna be super exciting to stand here and not just be watching this on youtube is like it's really like unique and it, i feel very honored because you haven't had very many people here no nope. no well the house isn't even done yet so oh you guys smell like, like new house whoa paint so they're, they're painting in the house right now so yeah enjoy, enjoy. whoa <sighs> bro what the heck i love the open feel <laughs> like, an echo. like when you look at how how high the ceiling, how high is that? 20, 20 feet, yeah, 20 feet, yeah, yeah. 20 feet. Yeah, so this is the front living room. Okay. Car's gonna go on the wall right there. What is? Car, I'm gonna put my Ferrari race car on the wall there. And there's the outlet right there, so you'll be able to turn a light switch, and the headlights and the tail lights will turn on, it'll be super cool. <laughs> Shut up! We'll be back to see that. What's your kind of like ETA to having this side done so you can actually live here comfortably? So I should be living here in a week. Oh, really? Yeah, a week, yeah. So, so I mean, this, this is, is all painted. This is basically done. done. You need the oven done. doesn't work, the stove top doesn't work. Yeah, exactly. um, but I have, I have, no, I don't even cook anything. never cook Is this your first house you bought? This is my first this house. This is first this house, house you've never owned before. <laughs> I don't know anything about houses though. Like literally, I know nothing about houses. Dave had knows houses. a little. Yeah. I know nothing. He coached me. That's the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> What's this made out of? So this is a granite countertop. Wow, that's like. And I love it. Has like this waterfall. Yeah, so the waterfall. Down, like all the veins, like match. Oh, up that's right cool. There. And again, just to give you guys some perspective of how big this is, like, like Dave looks like he's a mile away when I don't zoom in. My wife would really like this. Tash, I know you would love this. This is totally your theme. Like the black and the white is like right up my wife's oh, alley. The funny thing is, we're actually gonna tear all these cabinets out. What? what? We're gonna put like a big hood, like a range hood, oh, right yeah. here. Hmm. What are, oh, uh, true bachelor. All right guys, we are super pumped to announce we partner with Amaze once again, and this time giving you a chance to win this 2022 Audi RS e-tron GT while supporting an amazing cause, Oscar's kids. The best part is that taxes and shipping are included for US winners. All you have to do is go to amaze.com slash Audi and enter for your chance to win. Now, Damon, tell us, 
Why do you love this car? Well, first of all, the styling of this car is on point with basically every supercar that is made in the modern era. It's got Alcantara, it's got carbon fiber, and the best part is it has over 500 horsepower. Right now, we're gonna take you guys on a drive. Spaceship engaged. Dude. That's cool. Tell you this, it is nice actually how quiet these cars are. And it's no slouch, like check this out. You got me, I wasn't ready for that. I was ate the camera. Oscar's Kids is a charity that supports and enriches the lives of children and families navigating pediatric cancer and other childhood diseases. Created to honor the legacy of Oscar Keogh, a young boy from Ireland who passed away from DIPG at the age of five. Their mission as a charity is guided by the immense joy in which Oscar lived his life. The first thing I would do with this car, I'd do a fun road trip with my family. It's honestly super comfortable, yet sporty. Dad gets to have a little bit of fun, and the kids and the dogs and everybody else is super chill in the back. All right, guys, so for your chance to win the 2022 Audi RS e-tron GT, go to amaze.com slash Audi and enter for your chance to win. Every donation benefits the great cause, Oscar's kids. And then where, where does this go? Uh, so this is, this is basically just, I've dubbed it like an infinity pantry because there's not a door. It's just, I don't know, it's just a place to hide stuff. Okay, where are we going now? You just keep leading um, me let's, around. Let's I don't even know. Yeah. This is the master bedroom right here. Oh, I like the brick wall on the inside of the house. Yeah, that's really cool. That's it. And then this deck right here opens up to a hot tub eventually, so there's all the wiring and the stuff right there. My man. So Dave, I think, <laughs> if you could do it to the honor right now, <laughs> you know? Dude. To get, like, this tub is so big. Oh, bro. Like, look at us together. <laughs> I'll see my way out of this conversation. <laughs> Shower is no slouch. We have room for all of us in the shower. Come on, man. Bro, this is massive. It's enormous. No, all three of us could just chill here. All right, boys. We have a steam. What are we filming today? Hey. You guys see the toilet now. Okay. I'm very excited about this toilet. So you walk it's in. It's a throne. Look at that. Shut up. Isn't that cool? Dude. And you push this. He said. Three CPO, how do you say it? What's a three strong, CPO? Three CPO. And push it again. Freaking toilet. Drops, flushes, boom, done. How did you, what, what is that? You have to tell me that, I want one. So ironically enough, uh, long story short, I was given this for free because of something that happened. I'll tell you off camera. Yeah. But they just <laughs> gave it to me. I didn't have to pay for it. It's like a $3,000 toilet. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. sick. Yeah, it's insane. It's so Add cool. that to the list of things on my home. This is the walk-in closet that's currently filled with a bunch of junk. They're gonna be it's building this out soon. This is like another bedroom. So it's gonna be really, really cool when it's all done. Right now, I'm just storing everything. Everything in your home is so big. Like my, I thought my walk-in closet was big. It was wild. This is like, <laughs> things, this is like nice. nuts. This is, a, this is the size of someone's bedroom. Absolutely. I honestly would be totally fine living here, rent out the rest of the house and just have the garage. <laughs> right up here, I want to get some kind of like vintage motorcycle. Oh yeah. And there's power as well, so I'll be able to light it up. Some, some cool display right there. And yeah. the car right there. And the car, the, we'll see the front of the Ferrari from here. Hey David. Hey, how's it going? Good what? So what's over there? Stuff. Hold on, hold on. This is the bridge. I'm actually jogging. Look at this. <laughs> so we have just couches up here, like a hang on area? Yeah, yeah, hang on area. So like we'll have a TV right there, a couch. A sign. That's just a mechanic. Oh, is it? I don't know about that. It's a tall Get door. Get me out of here! Oh, okay. <laughs> One of about seven mechanic rooms in this house. So there's four bedrooms upstairs. What? Yeah, yeah, so. Bedroom, and each bedroom has its own bathroom. This view's cool. It's this. so cool looking down at all the cars. You There's build this so whole home around the, the principle of like it being a place to display your cars. Absolutely, you and for them. filming. Filming, displaying cars, like everywhere in the house. At some point, there's a cool spot where you can see cars. Okay, the bedroom you there, know? bedroom there, bedroom there. Yeah, uh-huh, yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna run through this one real quick. Hold on, just so you get it. We got this one. We got this one. We got this one. Beautiful. Walk-in shower. Wow. Another walk-in closet, bathroom. And then from that room into the... <laughs> this is the halfway house. <laughs> if you ever want to know what a Bugatti owner sleeps on, <laughs> this is what a Bugatti owner sleeps on. It's, it's a nice. real mattress. It's a nice mattress. It's a okay. real mattress. Well, yeah, yeah. I mean, the city council who's watching this video 
I may, yeah, don't worry about it. Don't, don't worry, we'll forget about it. Where are we going now? I saw more marble in here. Look at this. What the hell is this? So we've now entered the garage side. So this is the wet bar. So that microwave downstairs is, I mean, Did you say bar? Bar? <laughs> <laughs> we're in Utah, bro. <laughs> Fair enough. What the hell? The house is like really, really close to done. The garage is getting close, but then like the basement, the back cave, they still have months and months of work. You guys have no idea how big this place is. I can put 21 cars in without a car being blocked. So you know cars are double parked. So it can get any car out without moving another car. Did it's you say so 41? 21, no oh. 21, 21. I said 41 for a second, I was like. 21's a big number. But 21's yeah, so huge. Cars do you, oh, yeah, you have a lot. 16. Right now, I mean, you guys have. How many no, we sold a bunch. Well, I sold we, a bunch recently we, too. We went up to like 15 or 16 too, and then we were like, what are we doing? It's, it's we were we only did it for COVID because right. what else do you do? couldn't travel, couldn't do road trips. Like, so it was like, hey, buy another car, exactly. put another set of wheels on. So fun fact, our car payments for the leases on the cars, because where we live in order to get it a full write-off, it needs to be a lease. So all the leases on the cars and the insurance, is around ninety thousand dollars a month. Then there's employees, right. so we had yeah, to do we, hey, we had to do one twenty five at one point, one thirty to break even. Dude, British Columbia, it's beautiful though. <laughs> beautiful British Columbia. It actually says it on the license plate. <laughs> uh, another uh, mechanical room. Yes. Yes. My favorite. Mechanical rooms. What do we have? Four of seven. Okay. This is my favorite window in the entire house, though. Well, of course. Absolutely. How picturesque? Oh, how picturesque is that? That's a, that's a painting on a wall. Is that your library there as well? No. Let's no. Buy it. No, they should, let's buy it. Let's buy it. DDH. They should be selling yeah. construction there. So Could you imagine? <laughs> hey, James, we bought, we bought your neighbors. <laughs> Boom. All right, we'll be careful what we walk on. Oh, the echo down here is pretty neat. What? What? So those are steel beams. How was getting those in here? Was that it fun? It was pretty cool. They had a massive crane that hoisted them up and then they got like three dudes on ladders and lifts and they're all trying to, it was amazing to watch. We'll go with James and we'll take some cars out. We'll get some food. I think we're all hungry. We'll grab some of the cars. We gotta see the back cave. Let's, Let's go. go see the back cave. Let's yeah, go. yeah, yeah. It's dark down there because there's no lights. Back cave it is. Cause we are gonna, we had, a, James had an idea. We do have an idea, but we're not gonna put it in our video. We'll put it in James' video. And you have to go see his video to see what we do. But it kind of involves the back cave. That's why I wasn't sure. Oh. You weren't joking. Yeah. yeah. It is dark down here. It's really dark, yeah. You were right about how like down here, now it doesn't echo. Well, yeah, because it's all insulation. Yeah. Well, so I put my events for <laughs> Wow, okay, I'm gonna, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Dave gives me that look, jeez, yeah, bro. Yeah, but yeah. because it's all insulation, yeah, the sound, it's actually amazing for filming. Oh, yes, there we go. There's a step right here too, so. So this is gonna be a movie theater. Uh, eventually, so it's already like <laughs> wired and everything. In Utah, basements, everywhere has basements. The entire state the water does. So yeah. low, right? It's so, so it's like, it's almost free square footage. Yeah. It was so cheap to add all this. And in Utah, it's almost expected. Threw that word around, cheap. What is this? It's just a vault, storage vault. You have a vault, okay. This is crazy. I've met a lot of people with really nice homes. I've never seen anybody have a, a bank. A bank vault door in their house. This is like this is the, one of the, the big mechanical room. I wonder why he can get all his footage and vlogs up so country quick. Country or something? Like, is there a big plan? Yeah. What? What? Are, what? What? What huh? don't what? we what? know? Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. What don't we know? You guys know everything. There's no secrets. I feel like James is a little closer to the government here than we know. About. <laughs> all right, you guys. It's time for us to jump in the cars and go get something to eat. None of us have e eaten anything. I don't even know what I'm saying. I just need food. How's your blood sugar doing, Dave? Not good, Damon. James, you hungry? Starving. What time is it? You Canadians never eat. What do you want to do? Five Guys? Of course. Is that still your thing? Oh, of course it's my thing. Guess, That's our thing. Guess. How many times have we eaten at Five Guys together? Five times at least. So what are we taking to lunch? I want to go with you in one of your cars. We, we have to take the Bugatti. The Bugatti! <laughs> the Bugatti! Yeah. Let's get in the uh, the Bugatti and uh, off to Five Guys we go. Let's do it, baby. This is cool. Now, if you've never been in a Bugatti, you need to find a way to get into one. There is nothing like these cars on the face of this planet when it comes to automobiles, the way they drive, the sheer terror of acceleration that seems to never end from that W16 motor and the four turbos. Oh, and the beast is alive. The beast is alive. Now I've seen James drive this thing. He is no slouch and I'll tell you this, we will be at five guys and probably have eaten by the time Dave's caught up in the SVJ. <laughs> He's eating chips in the SVJ. What are you doing? 
We're going for a lot. <laughs> this car comes with two keys. There is the key to turn the car on, then there is the speed key. Dare I ask James if he's gonna whip the speed key out? Text them and get their orders, or I think so. They're gonna be a while. They are. Yeah, dude, the fries at Five Guys are still the best fries money can buy. They are because they bring yeah. in like real potatoes. Yeah, they cut them, them in house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, this car and this wrap gets so much attention. <laughs> I mean, it's because we're in the middle of nowhere, Utah. I know. Like this is, I'm pretty sure as of now, it's the only Bugatti in the state, and it's chrome and pink. to catch up. I want a Bugatti now. Let's make a deal. You drive this, you drive this to Colorado tomorrow, right? James will sell us the Bugatti. He said drive to Colorado tomorrow. What happened to you there? Dude, soon as we go on the highway, hard, like hard K on radar and James is gone. And Mark's like, all right, we're doing a pullover video. And I'm like, <laughs> local police love me. They're not gonna pull me over. They'll definitely pull you over though. <laughs> Sound of that car, are you kidding me? Dude, that car looks really good. That color, It's it so cool, crazy. man. People here are probably like, what the is going on <laughs> the lady pulled up next to us at the light and was just like smiling out the window just loving life so this is the tire slayer now and that's the lady slayer oh my god james you dog it smells good in here the last time what you bought me lunch and i said next time it's on me so it's on me oh i'm serious oh. it's on me oh. step up bugatti money i'll take <laughs> one of everything one of everything <laughs> You drive the SDJ, I'm gonna go around with my best friend James and the Veyron. By the way, enjoy that, because that never stops pulling, and you're gonna be like, you get you get the third seat, you know, like your falling feeling. I have nerves of steel, you can't phase me, James. <laughs> All right. Not on my watch. I actually do love the pink and chrome, like. Thank you. Conceptually, I would say it's weird, but I see it, I'm like, it's really cool. It turned out really good. It's really I cool. Really like That's it. enough Damon for one episode. Ah, that's enough Damon. We gotta spruce it up a little bit, make it a bit younger. You know, as we get older, James, it's harder and harder to get into these cars. Oh, I know. I feel I'm not like, ah, oh, where's the Dodge Caravan GT? Dude, the Caravan right now sounds so nice. Have you oh, seen our Caravan? Have you seen it? I, I feel like you talked about it so much at Monterey, I feel like I've seen it, but Dude. I don't think I actually have. I'll send you one. From now on, all our friends, send me one. all our friends get Dodge Caravans. <laughs> Tom Cruise sends like a, a pineapple cake at Christmas. We're gonna send Dodge Caravans. Instead of buying your friends supercars, buy them Caravans, You think I'm right? joking, I'm gonna send you a Dodge Caravan. Dude, you'd be like, that's um, weird. I'll drive everywhere. <laughs> It'll become my new daily. Oscar, my dog, would love it. Dude, it'd be perfect. He would love that. All right, here we go. Uh, I don't know where we're, do you know where we're going? We're just going for a drive, we're just going to cruise. Well, James, you live here, we don't, so I'll let I you decide what we're be. doing. We don't need it for a long drive, just like 200, 300 miles, it is DDE. We're supposed to be here uh, last night, by the way. We actually stayed uh, four hours away because it was just too late, so we slept in some hotel. It was so bad. We paid for hotel rooms down there and up here. If you would have told me that I could have stayed in your guys' room. <laughs> you could actually oh, stay in the room. Amazing, I love staying in hotels, we're just gonna have to pay for it. with Houston way back in the day. I remember that feeling of falling. It's exactly right, it doesn't stop pulling. And the transmission is like a CBT transmission, right? Something like this that, shit, I, mean, I don't you know. You don't feel it, you just keep it. pulling. Yeah, yeah it's like feel, just go, a big elastic go. band. Super wild. If you ever experienced it, you have to experience it one day. <laughs> kind of hard, because you gotta find some of the Veyron, I'll give you a ride. It's hard to find Veyrons nowadays too. It like, is. They're not driven very often, and there's only 450 in the world, so. That's crazy. Should we get one? I think you guys should yeah, get one. Hard this one's right for sale. Aren't you the money guy? David doesn't the make money. the decisions. The you make guy. the decisions. I'm like, I'm like David, smart for yourself. I am the biggest cock I'm like, sell everything. I love cars. Sell it, sell it, sell it. I look at the numbers. I analyze the views. I'm like, sell it, sell it, sell it. And the answer is to buy Huracans. It's to buy, <laughs> it's to buy Huracans, like, chop off the bumpers and do dumb things to them. Where are we going right now? A little drive? Uh, there's, a, there's a place called Guadalajara, Mexico, that is really nice. Oh, Mexico so, it is. That's where we're headed. Hey, Rivte! 
Yeah. Drew is in the house. <laughs> Get out of jail free card. That's all right, baby. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, almost, almost put the SVJ in prison. Yeah, sorry about that. That would've been weird. You guys would've had to stick around for a while. That would've been sick, actually. You could've stayed at the new house. You could've slept on the floor. Oh, Oscar in. would've loved it. We're what? We're moving in. We're Dude, moving in. all his bedrooms house. House. I got three kids, two kids? Two kids, he has three kids. <laughs> I'm gonna have a third kid. You just forget about wow, how many okay. kids he has. Really? All right, we now have taken all of the fuel from this gas station. This has sucked everything back. This has sucked everything back. This has sucked everything back. Once in high go. school. James! Bye! We have Kathy Shorts on. We're going for dinner on DDE. Wait, yeah. do I have to dress up for dinner or can you I wear have, chubbies? You can wear chubbies, but you know, like, I don't do know. Do I need a new shirt? No, strat Tell me how good. it is, don't tell me how it What's is. What's this? What's this hat? Uh, 8080 hat. No, we need a strat hat. Okay. Do you have a collared shirt? Do you own a collared shirt? No. Uh, yes, yes, I do. I do. But don't wear it. Oh, then okay. don't wear it. <laughs> we don't We're gonna go for a fancy dinner. Maybe I'll put on some pants. It's kind of chilly. Maybe I'll wear pants. It's an occasion. I rare the. You guys are the only guys to wear pants for. Let us. <laughs> Let's do it. We're gonna go for dinner with James, but we gotta go check into our hotel that we didn't check into last night. So we're hoping that we can still check in tonight, and that it's not sold out because everywhere is a conference. You guys are more than welcome to sleep on my carpet. Let that be known. Well, you can. I'm just saying. We're going to Walmart. We're all getting sleeping bags.